Welcome to another video. Um, this right here is going to be a review, um, unboxing, whatever you want to call it. Uh, not a food review, but uh, it's actually food for Luna. Um, I got this. It says it's an automatic cat feeder. Um, as you can tell, there was a cat on the box, but I drew wings and a little red um, dill up top um, for them and I crossed out the ears and put a beak on it so it's a chicken now um, but I'm going to be using this for the porch and it's going to probably take two or three days for this video to get finished because at nighttime when this was supposed to go off um, then um, we're going to see if it works because I'm going to try to train Luna to come inside the porch she stays outside the porch and stares up at the window just to wait for us to see her to, to come in so what I want to do, uh, when I say food, 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 she comes running like, like a linebacker all the way from the other end of the yard. Uh, so this has voice activated on it and uh, Wi-Fi. Um, it doesn't come with batteries, but it takes three D batteries. Uh, so just in case the power goes out, and it does kind of, not a lot, but in the country, there's a lot of trees. Um, I don't sit there and hunker down in the woods and worry about the tree limbs falling. That's stupid. P please, please do not fall on that power line. Luna needs her treats. Please, 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 please stop! <laughs> Okay, um, but it does have battery backup, uh, so that's a good thing. It has timers on here, so I can use it for my phone to time it. What I want to probably do, I think I'm going to time it every five minutes for six or seven times for it to go off and put a little corn. I think you can adjust how much you could feed it at a time. So uh, uh, I'm going to uh, put, the, put it in the feeder and have it... Uh, just a little bit of uh, corn or something that's dried corn, something she likes that doesn't go bad. So if we're gone for four or five days, it doesn't mold in there, it's sticky. Uh, you probably don't want to put anything wet in here. That's what that's what I said. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm staying my ground on that. But uh, something that she likes is treats that uh, maybe six times in a row it comes out so it gets her to, to, to coax her inside of the uh porch when the automatic door closes i'll set the automatic door like 45 minutes to close after this goes off so she doesn't run back out the door so i have to i have to figure that out okay so but i'm a chicken whisperer if you didn't know bo attaway um thank you very much for sending this hat i do appreciate it uh but this right here let's get back to here this right here um the box came, little, little, little dented right there. Little something got to it, like wanted to feed on that. But luckily it came with this uh, bubble sheath that goes over here and it did protect it. So that was, uh, that was a really good thing. So thank you for packing it very good. That's what I... <laughs> um, but, but back to the story at hand. Uh, it has a top that comes off. Has a little inside there. Has a little, whoops. Has a little bit of um, a wheel down in there. You can't see it. It's a plastic wheel, uh, metal bowl, and a tray. The tray slips right under there. I'm not sure what this is. I don't know if it's a dehumidifier or some kind of 
uh, deal. Um, not really sure on that, but uh, there you go. You can see it better. And we're going to read some, some of these black parts in this paper that they, they gave me some paper and they said read the black parts. So I'm going to read um, all the black parts on here. It has the phone so you can use it on your phone. Um, this costs $70 on Amazon, but you can click a $10 coupon and it is $60. So it's uh, the 7% off is $69.99. Um, $7 off will be 63 three dollars okay but uh i'm going to read a little bit off to you right here it says the automatic cat feeder 2.4 gigabyte wi-fi enable cat food dispenser timed cat feeder with desiccant bag for small cats dry food i don't know what desiccant is maybe you guys can tell me in the comments um auto pet feeder with dual power supply and anti-stuck food for pets so it has an anti-stuck thing. I guess it'll, it'll, if it gets stuck, it'll back up a little bit and, um, and then continue. Uh, it took only like three days to get this, but I'm going to try to figure this out. Maybe while I'm on here, and it might be a little fast forwarding, uh, but I am going to go over the steps. So step one, download Smart Life app. Well, I'm using my phone so you guys can see this better okay well i don't think i need this phone right now because I'm, I'm viewing i'm viewing me of you watching me on this watching me viewing me um let me go ahead and download it see how easy it is to download go under my apps google play Just try to sell me something already. Nope. Okay. Uh, Smart Life. Smart Life, Smart Living, Volcano Technology Limited. What the heck is that about? Smart Life app. Register an account and log on. Okay. Well, let me let me get to you when I finish doing this. Not sure. It doesn't even show a picture what the app is supposed to look like, so you can click a button. Um, I'm just getting that right there, showing the uh, it's showing the little uh, that sign, but it says volcano or something. Like, what is that about? Okay, I'll be right back with you. I'm waiting, folks. I'm waiting. Okay, it downloaded in like 30 seconds. Hit agree, because you can't agree. Whoops, you can't use it. Sign up. Use that email. I don't use my regular email because I get too much mail in that. They're probably going to try to send me something. Um... So yes, I do use a secondary email for a lot of stuff. They're sending me a verification code and I put a password in. Whoops, what happened there? Okay, passcode's in, go to the app. Add, it says add device. So it's telling you how to do all this. Add, and I'm on the right one because that's the same picture it shows on here. So add device. Oh. Add manually. Um, yes, there's a lot of stuff on here. 
but it has lighting, sensors, large home appliance, small home appliance, kitchen. Uh, I'm looking directly for like a pet thing, but I guess small, small home appliance. Fan, air cooler, humidifier. Oh, wow. It goes a lot of stuff on this app. Uh, there's not a search button, but there's a lot to go over. Baby rocking chair, smart toilet. I'm, I'm guessing I'm in the right spot here. That's what she said. That's what she said. That's what she said. Pet house, pet house, pet ball, pet toys, pet food bucket, pet feeder with camera. This does not have a camera. Okay, pet feeder Wi-Fi, and it says 2.4. Um, I'm going to hook it up to the Wi-Fi. Reset the device first. I think I'm going to have to plug this in. So let me plug this in. I'll put these in so it doesn't lose the connection once I unplug the extension cord. Three D batteries, and I always say they have A, they have. C and D batteries, but they skip B batteries. I think they do that because people that do stutter, but bat let me get a B battery, they'd uh they they wouldn't really know what they're talking about. So I think they skipped the B battery. <laughs> okay. We are good to go. There's a button blinking blue. So it says press and hold the reset button. There's not a reset, but it says set for five seconds until the indicator blinks. It's already blinking, so I'm just going to go ahead and hit. It's blinking slowly or blinking quickly. It's blinking quickly. This is a pretty good app, easy app to, um, to download and to use. The interface is really nice. It even showed blinking fast, how fast it was blinking to show what fast really means. And I did have to look at it because... I'm not sure if they think that's fast or not. Oh, I didn't put my passcode in for the Wi-Fi. Okay, my passcode is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, I'm gonna hold it down again. Here we go. It's blinking slow this time. Now it's not blinking at all. There we go, it's blinking fast. Okay, we are on it. So let's see how long this takes to set up since I put the code in. If you didn't, if you missed the code, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is going to be a three hour video with all this stuff. Okay. It only took 24 seconds. So Wi-Fi pet feeder device added successfully. So I'm going to put Luna's porch feeder. Okay. Hit done. Now I already got an update. I just downloaded it. Why didn't you give me an update later? Okay. Then you had auto update, so upgrade um, automatically. But it says, please keep the power of the device connected during the upgrade process. The device will not be used during the upgrade process. Please be patient. Okay. Gotta get that out my system. And I have some uh, Oh shoot! Oh man! 
Well, dropped all this water on the floor. At least it's just water. I'll pick that up later. Hopefully, I, Tasha does not get back before. I'll get it later. Uh, but I do have some feed here. I can put it in here just to get it set up. Okay. Got that going. Now it says portion. Okay, it has a little portion size there. Look at that. Shows me the portions. One, two, three, four, five. So I am going to pick one and hit feed. Oh, it's already working. And nothing came out. Maybe it has to get primed. Nope, let me go around this way. Floor's a little wet. There we go. Look at that. I'm going to do a, um, a video with my other phone so you can get a, but oh, I can't do it with this phone. I got to do it with this one. Okay. Well, I am going to change the angle of the dangle here. Chickens are already outside making noise. Okay, here we go. And if you didn't believe me, I have to set this, there we go. Here we go, I'm gonna hit the button again. Look at that, I'm gonna hit two to see how much comes out now. Okay, well, there we go. Works really easily. So I'm gonna put this camera back here, hopefully it's um, be good for you. Don't worry about the, the drawers there. I know people have a problem with uh, cabinet doors open. Okay, well, that's set up pretty good. So the next step is to uh, put this on a timer. You can put it on a timer um, and they have a feeding record so you don't forget a feeding plan. Feeding plan is the timer. So. Off, offhand right now, it is really easy to set up. Um, just make sure when it says your Wi-Fi, don't just hit enter because it's going to go like it's trying to search, but you have to put your password in right there after it shows the, sig the, the, the signal of the Wi-Fi, put the password in and 20 something seconds and it was uh, already ready to go. Okay, I'm going to do the voice activated thing maybe right now. Let's see how to do this. Luna, food, 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 food. Okay. Now let's do this again. Hit one. I don't like the speaker how low it is, so I might have to do a high pitch. And I didn't even I didn't even look at the the, the black parts here to figure this out. Just hold the, the speaker, uh, the microphone button. It's a microphone symbol. Luna, food, 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 food. I think that sounds a little closer than the, the the other one I had, but let me try it one more time. Food, 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 Luna, food, food. Okay, let's, yeah, I'm doing, look, Luna is my Luna and I'm gonna get this correct on the camera or not. Don't judge me anymore.
Okay. It's not as loud as I would like it to be. Um, I might have to figure something out with that. I might put a... I'll, I'll, I'll figure that out later. But um, I think everything else is set up. So when I cut this off, let me unplug it. It's unplugged. Let me hit the speaker button to see if it's still working. Okay. I'm going to feed it. There you go. I'm going to feed it one more time. I'm going to do it one more time. From You can hear it over here. But, uh, but that's pretty much it. Okay, well, I am pleased so far. It does back up right here, um, but once they start eating, it'll, it'll come back down. Um, okay, well, uh, next step is to go out there and uh, put this on a timer and let uh, Luna see if she can hear it at nighttime. So I have to do some, some uh, stakeout, some stalking, um, and hide in the bushes to get her reaction. Um, of hearing this if it's loud enough so okay well thanks for um continuing to watch this far and stay tuned it's not over intermission Hey, I just thought about it before I went outside to uh, to try this out. Um, it was it was like really like muffled, so I was thinking the microphone's on this side, and I was correct. Um, so I went ahead and went on that side, and here you go. Luna, food, 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 food. Come on, food, food. Okay, if you guys ain't hungry right now. Luna should be, but uh, I, um, I am, I am keep saying right now, I'm pleased with this right now. And if you look on my website, um, I'm going to go ahead and put this on Amazon recommended items. So if you go to www.garbagedisposalstore.com, you will see this under chickens. Um, I'll put this under the chicken. Um, category so you'll see everything on that for different categories from automobiles electronics um, uh, just different stuff that I have on there just click it and anything on there that I do recommend um, for some reason if this messes up in a week or so I'll take it off but uh, some stuff might be pricey like the camera I'm using but very 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 good um, camera so uh, if it's on there and it's pricey it has to be good if I keep it on there because I'm, I'm cheap I do like to put uh, on there quality items at a reasonable price uh, but some stuff are kind of high but you got to pay got to pay to play that's what she said All right. catch me outside catch me outside how about that Hey, um, uh, the plans changed. Uh, I didn't, I didn't inform Tasha what I was doing tonight. So I'm going to do that tomorrow night, but it's, it's probably going to be best because I did get different kind of dried foods. Uh, I didn't want to put the wet, uh, the frozen corn, um, in there and it, it get clumped up and mold and stuff. So what I'm going to do, um, I did buy, it smells like a nasty spin wheel Chinese mukbang in here. Uh, that's what she said. Uh, but this is a uh, shrimp delish. Uh, this is Mary Minnows. And we have some breakfast blend raisin and spice. So we're going to see what she likes the best. Then I'm going to feed her everything else and save the best stuff. So when we're gone, she gets to have that, those treats. So I'm going to show you the married minnows. These are really married. It's not focused on there. It's focused on me. Hold on a minute. Okay. I'm not sure how this is not focusing.
There we go. Okay. There's the Merry Minnows. And uh, we have the raisins, spice, it looks like millworms. And last but not least, the shrimp delish. There you go. Okay. Well, we're going to put a little bit on the floor. We're going to put a little bit on the floor down here. I'm going to take this off the tripod and get closer to the floor and see which one um, that Luna likes the best. So let me do that real quick and um, we will uh, see what the winner is of these. Guess which one that you might think would be the winner and we'll see if you're correct or not. Okay, Tasha's going to bring Luna in here. Um, this is going to be the Merry Minnows. I chopped them up so they're the same kind of consistency of the bites. I got the Raisin and Spice um, stuff here, and I got the Shrimp Delish right here. So here she comes. Come on, Luna. Food. 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 Okay, play by play. She's looking at the shrimp. She's already tackling the shrimp. Do you want to try all the rest of them first, Luna? I think she likes the texture of those because they're fluffy like the locusts out there that, yeah, I told them it smells like a nasty mukbang, spin wheel Chinese thing in here. I'll have to probably shred them up a little bit and not make it a powder. You want to try the other ones? There's more. Try the other stuff, Luna. Here, here, Luna. Here, here. You want to try this? Come here. Come here. Try this. You just making a lot of noise today? Luna, come on. Try that. Like raisins? No? Millworm? There you go. Well, you like millworms. Okay, well, how about this? That is minnows. No? So we really don't. Do we have a winner? She ate a lot of the shrimp. Oh, wow. Okay. Well,. <laughs> I think shrimp's the winner, so you don't see any more shrimp. Here you go. Let me try some more shrimp. Okay. Well, I think the shrimp is a winner, so we're going to go with, with that. So uh, let's see if I can get this off of here without breaking it. Hey, Luna. You don't want to get a photo shoot before I leave? Hey. You want to say, want to say good night? Want to say good night? Come on. Oh, she likes to get in, in here too, but. Okay. Okay, well, that's all, folks. I'll see you um, tomorrow and, um, well, tomorrow night, probably about the same time this time, and I will wait for her to come in and get her used to that. So hopefully the first shot we can try it, and I'll, I'll still do it two or three times just to make sure she's getting the hang of it. But it might take about three, four, or five times for her to get the hang of it, but... We got about a month to practice, so that's what she said. Okay, good night. See you tomorrow. Hey, uh, Luna's already at the back door here, so I'm going to go to the front door, go through there, and then start the camera in the back, and then set the uh, uh, 
set the thing to go off for her um, because if I go back there now, she'll follow me back there. So I'll go to the front door and um, start the camera and I will see you uh, back inside when I'm watching Luna from inside and uh, you guys can watch her too. Luna, there you go. All right, well, I'll see you later, Luna. Talk to you later, gotta go. Okay, back inside, um, operation uh, <coughs> automatic feeder, go. some of this food. Come on, at least you came in here. Come here. Get some of this food. Get some of this food right here. You want, you want to go inside? There you go. There you go. There's a lot of good food in here. Try some. Huh? Say screw that. You want to go inside? Right there, it's all right there. Okay, okay. Well, it's the first day. Um, hopefully, it gets better. Hopefully, you can see some of this. I was in there to do it automatically, but I have it for uh, 7, 16, 7, 18, and 7, 22, I think, and then this closes at approximately 7.30. So she'll be eating this while this closes and then she'll be locked in here. So the 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 thought pattern is if we're gone, she's not going in the coop anymore. She knows she goes inside every night. So if we're gone and she's out and she hears this, she comes into this door and then it locks in on her and then she can sleep down here in her little nesting box and have food. So, uh, that's the thought pattern. So uh, we're, we're gonna get it. Uh, she's, she's learning where the food's at because once she goes inside, she knows where the food's at in there. So, um, okay, well, we're gonna continue this and I would do another one, uh, maybe for the next three or four nights and see how she, she goes um, with uh, training to do this. So thanks for watching this video um, and I'll see you tomorrow night, same video. So keep watching, don't fast forward. You know who you are. Okay, let's go inside, Luna. Oh, now you don't want to go back inside. Well, at least you know where the good food's at. I'll shut this off. Hey, got my night clothes on. Um, day two of the um, automatic feeder um, trial. So we're gonna try that out. Um, I'm gonna go cut my hair first and then be right back with you. All right, let's go. Okay, I have it set up right now. I'm doing it, trying to do it in the daytime. So when uh, Luna's not here, she don't, you know, when Luna's around here, she won't see me. So I'm gonna set this up. And I'll fade it in to when she's about to come and, and, and get it. But if you the uh, if you fast forwarded, shame on you. But here's the uh, the timer. Goldie's Goldie's in here, so she's gonna.
Yeah, yeah. Goldie's gonna reap the reward. So she, Goldie's gonna figure out that this, that's what this means, and she might be in here partying with, uh, with Luna when we're gone. But I just put Goldie out there, so we have to worry about this, and she already got back in the yard. So she's, uh, she's like a garbage disposal. She really, really eats up some stuff. <laughs> Don't you? And she sounds like a frog. You don't like the camera? Okay. Okay, well, this is about Luna, so let me um, set this up and we'll get her, we'll get her in here. Luna keeps going to the front freaking door. Past two nights, when I want her to come back here, when she's always coming back here, she's looking up at the front door. Luna, you're not, you're not getting faked out by the fake voice. She'll come in here when I'm in here, but this fake voice, she does not like. Come on, Luna. Come on. She just stare. She's over there staring. Yeah, you're going to have to learn that's what that means. There's food in there. Come on. Come on. You see it coming out? Come on. You, you don't like this bowl? There you go. It's in there. Okay, that wraps tonight up. Um, I'm gonna let her eat a little bit from there, and uh, I'm gonna call it call it a night. We're gonna try it again tomorrow. Um, I just wanted to show you guys. It did rain today, so uh, let me turn this light on. It did rain today, so uh, he actually came in and laid an egg in her little. Uh, it looks like the uh, uh, Mr. Back. It looks like Mr. Back. No, I can see it. But uh, that's how the material Mr. Back's on. She likes in the closet. But she laid an egg in there. So um, that's going to be tonight. Uh, got me a fresh cut. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh, so I'm going to um, close this down. And tomorrow we're going to try it again and again. Another few three, four, five days until she gets to knowing that that's where uh, the food's at. She's, she's down there now, um, still eating, so she knows where the food's at. So we're gonna, we're gonna get it, okay? I'm, I'm persistent about it, so it's gonna, it's gonna happen because I don't want her outside when we're gone, locked out, so. Yep, so. All right, well, good night, and see you tomorrow on this vlog. Hey, we are here at day three of trying to do the automatic Luna pet feeder. Um, I'm going to see if it works out today and continue on and on and on. Hopefully it works out tonight. If not, we'll see how the uh, videos go. Um, 
after this. It might just be the end of this and I'll have to update you in the future. Hopefully she's, she's get used to it, but it might take a week, two weeks or whatever, but hopefully it does before we leave town. So let me set this up and see what happens. Okay, uh, this is going to be more um, more intricate than I thought trying to do this. It's raining right now, and Luna just wants to go in, so uh, she came up by herself anyway, I think, and not worrying about the about that feeder. I'll do it on a drier day, and I'll have to keep y'all posted. Sorry it didn't work out that you, you're not seeing the results right now, but it's only th been three days, and... Uh, uh, I just have a lot of stuff to do around here. I'm, I'm probably going to stay up all night again. Um, I'm going to write a list of stuff I just need to cut off doing because this is getting way too overwhelming trying to do videos. And, and, and I want I want you guys to see a lot of stuff from the videos. And I just can't keep on um, doing the stuff in the same vlog. You know, I apologize. But it's just getting kind of hectic. I'm just going to start, uh, I'm going to stay up all night again and I'll get some videos edited um, so I can do some stuff around the house and it, back and forth is, is really getting to me. So I apologize guys um, and I will uh, see you next vlog. Um, write in comments, you know, what you did like out of the video um, and I know the ending um, is uh, a little saddening because you didn't get to see her really come in and the door close and everything work out picture perfect but that's life and that's what happened so see you again thanks for watching this vlog and talk to you later she does eat out of her bowl inside she knows where this is at she is a little wet but she is inside safe and sound is the most important thing so good night It's been a long night, guys. Been up all night editing. Um, I was going to round the vlog out, and I got to thinking, um, I need to let you guys know uh, what I really think about this. So this right here, um, as you saw the first day, I did uh, paint a little, uh, some wings and a beak and stuff on this cat because it's for a chicken. Uh, but out of five stars, I want to give it a four. Um, the price is pretty good. The Wi-Fi works great. Um, it's battery and um, it's plug-in powered, so that's good. Um, the voice is a little, it's its loud, I guess. For in the house, I guess it's, it's pretty decent if it's a cat or a dog in the house, a small dog. That, um, but it's, uh, the voice outside is not the greatest to me. And if I yell in this thing, it's going to be really distorted. So I didn't want to do that and blow the speakers. Um, so I'm going to at least give it a four four and a quarter out of five um it has plenty of food for a small animal um it'll last uh, i would say maybe a week um with this full for a small animal um maybe even more it depends like for luna maybe almost a week and a half uh but i really uh really do uh, like this I, I do have it on my website under uh amazon's I, amazon items I recommend so if you click that and go through everything this would be under the chicken item um, but I um, I have a lot of stuff recommended on there and if uh, for some reason in a month this thing isn't working like I want it to and it breaks or something happens I take it right I go straight there and take it up right off and and return it to Amazon um, but other than that um, I really do appreciate you watching this video um, I did stress out last night that I do have a lot of things going on and if you don't know even half the stuff I do today you'll be tired just just listening to me um, say how many how much stuff I do around here I do a lot um, and it's uh it's it's taking a toll on me as you probably could have tell last night I was really kind of almost wigging out 
um, I wrote a list, um, I wrote down the most important stuff I need to do and the least amount of stuff, the least important stuff I need to do. Instead of piling up 40 things that I need to do tomorrow, um, I might have 10. Um, so that cut that down and I pushed stuff back into another day where I can do a lot of little stuff in one day and get it taken care of. Um, but um, it's just trying to organize stuff that I got to do. Uh, the most, the the most important stuff uh, needs to get done right now instead of worrying about the little stuff that it's not really important. It's just bothering me because it's, I'm just real particular about stuff. But um, I have uh, I keep my um, uh, packaging of the goods um, number one priority as well as the channel doing videos, keeping those out and answering comments. So that is uh, my number one goal on that. Um, I've been getting more uh, more people getting tarps because under goods and other stuff I have the tarps on there as well. So I've been I have that on eBay as well. So I've been doing a lot of a lot of packaging, uh, but uh, keeps me busy. Um, I know I'm losing weight in the face. I'm losing. I've just lost some weight. I just cut my hair as you saw. Uh, so it's uh, it's 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 coming along. It's keeping me active. So that's what she said. So, so with that said. Oh. Oh, I can't take a nap. Um, about to run to the store since it is muddy outside, so I can't do anything in the backyard too much. Uh, I do have some run to the store to get some um, specialty items that people had ordered for the uh, pickles. Um, so I'm doing some specialty pickles. Uh, if you didn't know about that, uh, email me if you want anything specially made. Uh, it just has to be paid for before I make it. Um, but um, I make almost i said almost almost anything so if you want pick a pig's feet you might have to go somewhere else i don't do those but okay with that said talk to you later hey thanks for watching the video again if you haven't visited my website yet um the the address is www.dougarbagedisposalstore.com. You can navigate through the top, all these links right here. Um, there is actually a question and comment form. If you have any questions or comments, uh, fill that out, and it'll go straight to my email. At the very bottom, there is a free newsletter. Just sign up for right here, um, and you will get a weekly newsletter. So uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting on? Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit see all so you get all the notifications and don't miss the videos. Please comment. I like to um, listen to your comments uh, and respond to you. So I do like to interact with you guys. Uh, please share the video with your friends, family, even your boss. And have a great day. Let's meet other plans.